decided to record my this this my work. I've done uh, this textures painted. I painted. Uh, <coughs> I did this work in Substance Painter. Uh, I'm not sure how can I record interface. Anyway, I, I don't think it's significant. Uh, for demonstrating my work I've done on this model. Uh, I completely painted from nothing. Uh, from blank model I started. can show an alternative wood type there is a, okay I, I turn it on the alternative one this is the second version so called more red color okay um, I would like to demonstrate uh, parts, a uh, composition uh, of textures. This is actually a BPR uh, shading uh, materials. And I would like to demonstrate what it can com uh, a composition of materials, BPR materials, textures that are constructing, comprising this uh, this work. So wood. Okay, this one and. Okay. This is a blank model. This is a blank model. Okay. We have to save, turn off, keep. Ah, no. Nice. This keep is the second. Ah, touch on off. No. Okay, maybe I can pause it. Okay, save is completed out of save. So this is the model. Now I'm adding different components. So this is the first version, this is the second version. Come on. Second version. Why it's so slow? Um, wait a second. This is unbelievable. What? Okay, here it is. Um. Reading method. Method. Here 
gonna use the metal. I turn down metal. Okay, there are so this is 4K texture or maybe 8K, I don't remember. Okay, so um, let's turn on this is a mutation of a wood and it's becoming gold some sort of white white I'm not sure how they call it. white things growing on wood I tried to paint mutation becoming wood becoming gold this is chicken house so chicken house Okay, let's turn on the moist. This is moist. Okay, uh, green. Moist growing on a wood. Okay, dirt. Now I'm turning on dirt layer. So actually it contains also poops, <laughs> chicken poop it all over. So it consists of chicken poops and mud dirt layer. Uh, so the chicken are walking all over mud and breaking that into a house and pooping and pooping everywhere. So they can stand here and poop, stand walk over here and poop. And the mud. Uh, it's crashing all over the house. And finally, final layer is dust. So the dust means it's carrying dust and it's accumulating in the cavities. Uh, so this is uh, this orange light is dust. So once again, turn on, turn off. The render area. So maybe okay, render. <sighs> Here it is. Okay, let's try bring it forward a little bit. Okay, so that's it, I think that's all. Contains all the, the PPR shading, contains all the information for specularity, roughness, 
and different uh, color. And that's why it would be the same as in uh, Substance interface, iRay, or GPU basic rendering, and for in any uh, 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 real time game engines like Unreal or Unity, the result will be the same. Uh, and also in image basic renderers like Arnold or Renderman, the result will be the same based on PBR shading. In the same way as I'm demonstrating right here. Let's take a, a Okay, so okay. Let's take a look at I'm rotating the light. That's it. Uh, this is it. Uh, chicken house. It's not the complex model, the most hard work I've done by painting you know, these textures and the UV coordinates appropriate for painting. The model wasn't that hard. So it's a low poly, a couple of, and they also need just, uh, just align boxes, not that complex. Uh, if, I'm, if I will do this model, I, I think I, I'll create it a better one. So the all reality, this photo reality is coming from PBR Feeder, which I created. That's it.